be honest, it wasn't far away from finding that top corner. Johnson at full stretch, I don't think would have had it covered. Just allows York to stay on the front foot, keeps his pen in our own box. So another ball comes into the box. It's a good ball as well, and it's dropped to the back post, and York equalise. York equalise, Malachi Fagan Walcott. Just tapped home at the back post. And York a level into the first minute of stoppage time. And really, he looked dangerous from a caller early in the half, and now he's got it. It's just gone all the way through, and it's a tap in from Wayne Fagan Walcott at the back post. Yeah, as you say, York have threatened from these set pieces all game. As a Looks like Ollie Pierce is going to go into the book here, gets a yellow card for something. He's still complaining to the referee about it, though, but not too sure what that was for. Can only imagine it was something in the celebrations, but yeah, as we were saying, New York are threatened from these set pieces. All game, Town haven't dealt with them initially, and we've needed to not been able to get the ball forward and away when we've had the opportunity to, and it's just dropped perfectly for them at the back post. As a play will stop momentarily before we can get going again yeah Pyro on the pitch just had that removed before uh, play these starts but you don't expect there'll be at least five minutes left to play yeah, it should be. We know we hadn't even completed the first one. We've now played just over two of the five. So there's still plenty of time for either side now to find a winner. Hotty back to Smith, who's going to launch that high. Headed by Fagan Walcott. Pew to Oluwabore. Throw into town. Comes off batter. The Toro two. Oluwabori couldn't thread the needle. But he bounces back towards Hunt. And now Chadwick will try and bring it forward. Too quick for Cummings. Ref says advantage. Aguiar. Nathaniel George. Billy Chadwick. Back to Felix. Nathaniel George. Twist and turn and gets that into the six yard box. It was Adam Adatoro. Involved to put that away and out for a throw. Felix Hunt flicks toward Chadwick. Aguiar can't quite arrange his feet. Batty, able to release. Shot, I think, had a lot of sting taken out of it, and Johnson will roll out towards Flo Hotte. Looks to spread it early. Well defended by Fagan Walcott. Had to intercept. Gets it back from Felix. Nathaniel George on the left. Hunt wants it centrally, gets it. Aguiar. Battling with Adatoro and it's a free kick to York City. Just did too much there. Adatoro once again grabbed hold of him, didn't let go. Just with a couple of minutes left, it's another good opportunity for York to get the ball into the box and cause us some problems. Maybe a little too far out necessarily to go for goal directly from this free kick, but it is very central. Got three men over it discussing it. See Batty is one, I think Hunt's one of the other ones. was there but he's now walked away so it's either going to be Alex Hunt or Dan Batty that takes the free kick Batty chips in towards the back post that's headed across goal and York has scored it's 2-1 and York has scored twice in stoppage time I think it's Pierce who's got it and the Shaman again failing to defend set pieces and what's been a really good performance for town for 
the best part of 90 minutes going to go away with empty handed York lead late for try one as you say done almost everything right throughout the 90 minutes and then it's two lapses of concentration from set pieces in added time that are going to cost us here quite fast approaching the six at the end of minutes but I imagine we'll still have a minute or two left to play but since York got their first town haven't looked like getting out from the back 